Hi guys, thanks for tuning in. This is a painting we did on a live stream just over a week ago now, and it forms part of our efforts to help the humanitarian crisis in Ukraine. So right now we're going to take this into the back, get it stretched around the frame, and then hopefully it's going to be ready for the auction. Okay, so once that is done now, that's just got the frame, which measures 150 by 110, uh, approximately centred, because we've got a little bit of stretch uh, and give over with the canvas that's going over the sides. Uh, so that's pretty much square in the centre now. And we'll get the staple gun out, and we'll start stretching it. Now then. <clears throat> Whilst we're doing this, I may as well give you a, uh, a master class in stretching paintings and canvas. <laughs> so, we're going to start off uh, from the centres, okay? So I'll just pick it at a side, it doesn't matter which side. And what we're going to aim for is to do our first stretch across the centre. Now, I'm just going to run over it with the heat gun, you can make a bit of noise now. I'll explain why in a second. Paints that we use, not necessarily maybe for every paint, but certainly the ones that we use, uh, a lick of heat uh, just softens them up a little bit and allows them to become a bit more pliable, a bit more manageable, and just helps us get a better stretch. That's all. So all I've done uh, is lick the edges and just briefly down the centre, just to loosen the paint up a little bit, and it just allows us to get a bit more stretch. That's all. Just good practice. Right, so I'll flip it and I'll do the same on the ends as well. The nice thing about doing this what I call the old-fashioned way with your hands, is actually you can feel what the canvas is doing, which is really good. I really like that. There's no substitute for, for doing it by hand. Okay. Moves around the other side. Start to see this nice diamond shape that's appearing now. So we start, always start on the centres, and then what we're trying to achieve is this. You can just see that look, that nice diamond appearing now. Because now we're going to start and move from the centres and go outwards, and that's that is the correct way. It's the only way to stretch your painting. So we don't get great ripples on it. Right. Shall commence. We're going to be using some stretching pliers now. So 
can give the canvas a bit of a tweak. And when I first start, it's always good to, to feel the canvas by hand, which is why those first four uh, staple positions are always done by hand. But now we break out the pliers, because these are a great tool to use. Really, really good. And again, you can still feel what's going on quite happily. So we're going to give that a really good tighten up, and a tweak at the end. And then what the end does, it pulls this section out. Right, some staples in. Okay, so now we're going to do the opposite side, and then we're going to move on to the other side. Sides, we're going to turn our attention to the corners. Corners very, very simple. Now, don't worry too much about this. We have got a video on how to stretch canvases, so I'll pop a link down for those somewhere. Uh, but essentially, just give them a little bit of a loosen with the heat gun, and we're just going to do a standard gallery wrap. I'll show you because it's just you do it by hands. You kind of do a single fold, a pinch, and a pull over, and that's going to be our corner approximately. All right, so. Do that once more, a uh, little pinch, it's like a little V-shape, a little pinch, over it goes. And that's our corners, right, got those staples. And then I'm going to trim that little bit off uh, when we finish the whole thing. Okay, right, so we'll give that a little bit of a trim, pop in the corner wedges, and it's done.
it's done. I painted this on a live stream and now it's up for auction. We want to help and this is our way of doing it. So have a bid. There's a link down in the description. If you're the lucky winner, then congratulations. And wherever you are in the world, we will deliver it for you. That's it. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. Home.